Now in this video, we will see how to express the concentration of solution. So first, you want to know why we need to express the concentration of solution. Okay, because a solution is containing both solute and solvent. We don't know what is the amount of solute present in the solvent and what will be the nature of the solution. So to know all this, we want to express the concentration of its concentration of solution. So composition of a solution can be described can be described by expressing its concentration. Okay, here we can explain about the composition of a solution. Okay, composition of a solution can be described by expressing its concentration okay because it is containing different different solutions containing different compositions of solute and solvent okay to describe that composition of a solution we need to go through this express uh, expressing of concentration of solution so this can be expressed either qualitatively or quantitatively okay so in qualitatively we can express the solutions either dilute solutions or concentration depends upon the amount of solute present in that so here the solute is present in very low very less very less quantity okay in dilute solutions so the solute is present in very less quantity okay so solution contains two components that is solute and solvent so in this less quantity of solute is present okay but in concentrated solutions the quantity of the solute is very high so when large amounts of or more amount of more quantity of solute is present then that is known as concentrated solutions okay so that means this is in the case of qualitative method so qualitatively the composition of a solution can be expressed by using two terms that is dilute and concentrated in dilute solutions less quantity of solute is present in concentrated solution more quantity of solute will be present but in real life these kinds of description can make a confusion a little bit confusion okay so we need to express this concentration in terms of quantitative analysis okay quantitatively now we want to explain about its composition okay so we have different types of modes of expressing the solution in quantitative method okay in that we can also explain or we can also express the composition of a solute present in the solution by using its percentage okay in that percentage mode the first type is mass percentage method mass percentage method so in this mass percentage method we can express the concentration of a solution that means here we can explain we can able to explain about the composition of the solution okay here we need to take the mass of the solute okay here i have taken 100 grams of solution just imagine I have taken 100 grams of solution in that some grams or some amount of the solute is present and some amount of the solvent is present. Okay, that we need to know. So, your mass percentage is defined as the amount of the solute which is dissolved in amount of the solute in grams because we have taken the term mass. So, we need to take in grams. So, it is the amount of the solute in grams which is dissolved in 100 grams of the solution it is dissolved in 100 grams of the solution now some amount of solute is dissolved in a solution in which solution 100 grams of solution in that 100 grams of solution whatever may be the amount of the solute which is dissolved that can be expressed by using this mass percentage it is defined as the amount